Hello Aquarius, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your daily tarot reading for the sign of Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. So I hope you're well. Remember this reading won't be for everyone. Take what resonates for you as always. We're looking at the 19th of October, though these readings can resonate a few days longer than when they're released. And I've changed tables. Here's Aquarius. Uh, the neighbour next door started banging or doing some work next door so I've kind of moved into the peace and quiet <laughs> so we have compromise let's see what we have with that what do we have for Aquarius please angel spirits guides message for Aquarius for the 19th of October 2022 message for Aquarius thank you thank you five of wands the tower eight of wands and we have the king of wands male or female can be Aries Leo Sagittarius or the energy of the card here really can be any sign this could be I mean the king of wands is a very good as a leader male or female but also somebody who's good at taking the lead in their own life very confident driven go-getting also very courageous this five of wands energy here Aquarius this is an energy of everybody wanting to win and it can be about conflict in the sense that everybody wants to win. Nobody wants to back down, you know. So this is somebody who may well be competing for something because the circumstances demand it. The Tower is a card of, of change, significant change, a life-changing event that shakes the very foundations to the core of an area of your life or across your life. So it might well be for some of you there's a tower moment happening and you need to be in it to win it in the sense that you're competing for something here because the situation requires that you do. There's a strong energy here with the, the tower and all this one's energy or taking action. Three one's energy is all about action and empowerment and being courageous and moving directions of where there's potential and growth and success and it's it's all because of this tower. So something's happened here. I mean, the tower can be about uh, changes in your employment, could be redundancy. For some of you, it could well be something's come to an end, like I said, in your money, career, finances. It can represent also if a tower moment is ongoing <clears throat> in the sense that you're, you're reading the signs on the wall and you're kind of like, okay, the, in this change, in this deep transformation here of the tower, I need to take action. I need to go and take care of me. You know, that might be the energy here to get a stability in times of instability here. So that could be a company going bust. It could be a company merger. It could be restructuring going on. You understand what I'm saying. It's whatever this tower is. I feel that you're in it to win it. That's what I'm saying. This is opportunity and change. And we do have opportunity here. The eight of wands can be. There's numbers of opportunities. But it can be very good also in terms of if you have been pursuing that, if you have been competing for opportunities, if you have been taking action because circumstances demanded it, this can be very good in terms of forward movement, forward shifts, in the form of communication and good news. The King of Wands can be somebody who actually holds one of these wands, one of these opportunities. He can offer an opportunity, jobs, business opportunity, career opportunity. The King of Wands can hold that and offer it. There may well be, however, you can see the rebalancing energy here. There may well be some compromise needed. And I feel Spirit is telling you, be open to compromise because it might well be spirits working through this person to bring you, you know, uh, the opportunity and change, is what I'm getting here, Aquarius. 
It feels like there's some good news, positive shifts happening for you. Uh, and it could well be that that comes in very, very quickly indeed and moves very fast. But it feels like it's linked to, with this King of Wands. The message is be open to compromise. Oh my goodness, opportunities don't happen, you create them, absolutely. Okay. Yeah, the message at the bottom of that deck, I did take a sneak peek. We have, I never lose, either I win or learn. So whatever this tower is, you've learned from it. What do we have for Aquarius, please? Magical blessings. Whatever you're going through, you're being assisted by magical fairy blessings. The fairies say you can bless others too. There's a feeling a compromise is needed, but it will be worth it. That's the energy here. Okay, that's what I have for you. I hope you enjoyed your reading, found it helpful, useful. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe. I wish you a lovely day. I will see you next time.